Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to create a new project in Visual Studio Code. But first guys, I will be showing you how to get it in the first place. So let's go to the URL section, search for Visual Studio Code and from here guys, you can get it from this URL which is code.visualstudio.com. Click on this URL and then you will find download for Windows. Now you can stable build so you can download it through here or you can click on this arrow and download it for Mac OS through here or Linux through here. Of course, there is other downloads ways, so you can click here to, uh, to have them, as you can see here, or you can just open it on web like so. Now, guys, make sure that you are not confused between Visual Studio Code and Visual Studio. They are completely different software, so don't actually download this software, because they do so much so many tasks that are completely different now guys let's go back to our software and now let me show you how to create a new project first of all let's go to the uh, desktop as you can see here and it's basically as simple as you can see all you need to do is actually click on for example here new folder so uh, sorry let me just close this so here new folder and all you need to do is click in here rename uh, project and as you can see it is pretty much it so you can just click on project here you can go back to visual studio go to here open folder and let's name it project select folder and here it is your new project so now here you can add files for example um, home page.html here you can add whatever you like and you can add for example css so uh, home page um, design css or something like that i don't know so here it is so yeah you can do whatever you'd like guys in here and you can even actually make folder inside of this folder so let's name it a uh, website and we can actually drag these two and Put them inside of this so move so they are under websites and yeah guys that's how you can make your project in visual studio code so thank you a lot for watching and see you in the next tutorial